Uh, Rhapsody, mm -hmm. could you just read a little bit of text or just speak about a paragraph worth of, of speech? Yeah, not a problem whatsoever. Um, once upon a midnight dreary, as I wandered, weak and weary, through many a quaint and curious volume of forgotten lore, as I nodded, nearly napping, suddenly there came a rapping as though someone gently tapping, tapping on my chamber door. That was beautiful. Truly beautiful. Sheila, can That's you do something? Um, yeah, I expect more or less the same thing from you. Okay, uh, okay. Recite Sweetie. the exact same thing. Go. No. <laughs> <laughs> Hello there. No. No. Are you stupid? What should we do? I don't know. It's up to you. Okay, let's do. Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo? Deny thy father, refuse thy name, and, if thou shalt not, be sworn by love, and I shall no longer be a Capulet. Okay. Equally beautiful. Lolash! You, you've, you've frankly got quite a lot to live up to at this point, but uh, I have faith. Okay. Um, it's a reefer. Do you want some policeman? It's a reefer. Do you want a blast? It's okay. a reefer. Do you want some policeman? Or would you prefer me to shove it up your ass? All right. Um, and on that note, that really this funny. is all going in the recording on my end. Um <laughs> Greetings and welcome back everyone to our Mellow and to Board Game Night, where I am joined by Rhapsody, Shelab, and Lolash. Say hello everyone. Hello everyone. Hello everyone. Well done, Shelab. You even mostly said it in the in the tone that I used. Uh, that's impressive. Okay. Yes. Now we are actually playing our mellow with the latest DLC. And by the time that this video goes up, you'll have about a day to wait before it is released on Steam. This is, of course, the Usurpers DLC. Lolash, or, or Rhapsody, would you like to explain a little bit about this DLC? Sure. Um, yeah. So the Usurpers DLC adds uh, four more heroes, one from each of the clans. Mm-hmm. Lolash? Uh, it also adds a bunch of new cards to the decks. And I believe it also changes, um, uh, like, fortified settlement mechanics. Uh, I haven't had a chance to go over all of the details. All I know is that I'm excited because... I'm sure any... we, we will have plenty of time to discover all of the nuances. <laughs> and uh, with that excited. said, we're probably all going to go for some of the new characters. So I, I'm definitely going to be looking... For new characters, so my usual river gameplay is not going to be, not going to be going on. <laughs> unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to snipe uh, the king at the last Hank. moment. Oh. Right. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go, Lady Sheila. Ready? Right, up when you ready? Right, Lady Sheila. Happen. Hang on, I always lose the ready button. Got it. There we go. Two I'm remaining. One. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. The race is to <sighs> analyze and select the best hero. Let's go. I've picked my hero. The horror who trades in secrets from beyond the veil. The Death Teller, Sargon. Okay. They just sound badass. So, I'll take it. I am going with the Shield Maiden. Now, this is a particularly interesting ability. Do do the rest of you have your ability selected? Uh, not yet. I'm just quickly... Yeah, right, I'm ready. Okay. Well, quickly read out what your ability is. Sure. sure. Um, my ability is Veil Gazer. The top card of each deck is face-up during card draw. Fair I've nice. also taken the black, opal, and think, so I get stealth in settlements day and night, and I get plus one to my wits. Okay, well, we might have to wait until the game to read out the rest, but my shield maiden, basically shield cards that are burnt in battle, reflect an enemy's attack. Oh. Don't just block it. Okay. I see. Mm, selecting my... Choice of things. Um, oh. That one's a nice one, actually. Um, we did turn off turn timers, didn't we? I have no idea. Rhapsody set it up. I'm assuming the Rhapsody would, wouldn't have forgotten to turn off turn timers. <laughs> okay. Lady Sheila, you're up. Mm -hmm. 
I believe it is your move. It's my my turn. Um, I'm trying to find my description of my character, but uh, basically, I think I'm a spellcaster sort of bear, basically. A spellcasting bear. That sounds that sounds awesome. That's, uh, uh, it's typically the bear. She Labs abilities is in forests, spells cost one magic less per current and adjacent forest. Oh, wow. And Gore can cast to any forest on the map. Wow. Ooh. Okay, that's actually pretty awesome. A simple bear with a serious affinity for forests. And uh, Lolash has already mentioned the horror who tra uh, trades in secrets from beyond the veil. That's actually a pretty awesome title for your character. Oh, yeah. Confess. <laughs> I'm pretty pleased. Well, oh, I wow. put myself in a forest just for the sake of it. You turned into... You... I turned oh, into shit. some sort of... Like, it's Treebeard! It is Treebeard! What up, Treebeard? <laughs> I know! I was like, did you just cast a spell? No, you just walked into a forest. Okay, it wasn't lying about you I having a serious affinity for forests. I should keep you safe and safe is where I should keep you. <laughs> oh my lord, when you're moving around, you're literally teleporting. I teleport around, that's that so That cool. is so awesome. That is cool. So amazingly right. awesome. Right. I'll give people a quick rundown of Elysia, the character I'm going to be playing. She's yeah. an architect. End your turn on the settlement to fortify it permanently. Elysia ignores fortified movement penalty. I have a topaz to gain double income from settlements. And I've also wow. got the watch so that I guarantee first symbol match on perils. Wow, that's a pretty good collection, to be fair. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, nice. I, I looked at it and I was like, I I got to take this real fucking quick. This is going to get taken from me. Yeah, she has got Jade, so plus three magic at dawn, if in a forest, which is an amazing thing for her. And, and uh, plus one spirit because of the feel gem. I'll be so honest, I didn't know what I was doing, so I just thought, well, this is kind of a magic bear, so I'll kind of go for spirit and magic-y stuff. No, that, that mm. makes absolute sense, and you, you've actually built a character. That, if you really do focus on forests, you're going to have a very easy time with things. Um, da -dum -dum -dum. I'll find some way to screw it up, don't you worry. <laughs> okay, I will count on you. Avak, you would love to have my hand of cards right now. Really? Yes, so many shields. <laughs> um, Dare I say, good thing he doesn't. Okay, well, we're going to be off. You know, Avak, I've missed our mellow. I know! Like, I Amelo had, is I missed one of those games that, that... It's just always fun, every time you play it. Oh, exploring. Oh, a bane. Bloody banes. Well, ah. at least it didn't push you onto any of the marsh. I know, that uh, was well, good. Okay, well... Um, nothing really to burn here. Whoa. Oh, wow. Ye gas, that thing. Nice. That was a killing blow. It killed Whoa. me straight away. Whoa. That is the first time I've seen a bing roll that well this early. That's like super bing. I know. That was brutal. That was completely unexpected. For you? <laughs> oh, man. Um, so, Rhapsody. Yes. That was I, I particularly gave you awesome. I, I did see that actually. It popped me out of the uh, the vision of the combat so that I could see the uh, merchant's agreement that was played on me. You also gained a spirit stone for just being I know. where you were. I moved into the ruins. I'm like, God, I hope a spirit stone spawns on my face. That would be great. <laughs> Did you actually think that? I'll give you yeah. props if so. That is actually pretty yeah. awesome. Well done. It's a good place to end your turn because, you know, if you're not rotted. Yeah. Guys, I'm trying to find my quest. Um, what's the symbol for a quest again? It'll Cause... be like a, a banner, like a shield. A green shield. Uh, for it? you, it would be probably, yeah. Yeah, cool. I yes. see it. That's perfect. <clears throat> Thank you. You're welcome. <gasps> what? Wow. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh, of course you didn't. did. I didn't mean to. I, no, my it's quest is on that tile. Well, you shouldn't <laughs> have said that, but... Um... I'm just trying to explain why I randomly attacked. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna roll. Can I, I just think. Say, 
She lab, your character looks fucking terrified. I know. All I'm terrified. the time. I'm terrified. <laughs> I'm gonna probably get killed now just for doing that. Oh no, you have infinity HP, it's fine. You do have a lot of HP, yeah. but I did win the fight. Never mess with rats. So, Never. I take it I can't go onto a tile without kit, uh, like beating up the thing on it then. Yeah. Yeah. In this no. game. That's yeah. fine. It was the cause of much distress for me in the last series where the King's Guard kept cock blocking me from my actual goal. Ah. Uh. With Talisman, you can choose to go onto a tile. Um, but with this, you if you go onto a tile, you have to deal with whatever's there first. I see. I've got to say, Sargon is quite. I mean, it, just everything about Sargon is, is just, yeah. I'm I'm really digging him. I'm really, really pleased. He looks pretty cool. Played Feral. Oh, God. You fight on minus one wits until the end of the next <laughs> turn. Uh-oh. Goodbye, Sheila. Goodbye. Nice knowing you. <laughs> Aww. Well, you're standing in his way. There's well. a settlement over there. I mean, to be fair, yeah, if he wants to go to that settlement, it's the only sensible way is to go through you. It's my settlement. Uh, that's I need my to quest. It. My quest is on that settlement, so. Wow, your quest really, <laughs> really messed you guys up. It's like, no, you're not allowed to have friends. Uh, uh, burning a moon is. It is nighttime, but. I mean, it's, it's not bad, oh. I suppose. Oh. He's trying to help himself, I don't know. No. no, you didn't get enough defense. But he's not going to be able to kill you. I will force her back, though, and then... Not quite. Oh, God, do it again. And then I'm going to go in again. <laughs> Poor old Sheila. That's my own fault. I feel vaguely complicit just watching this slaughter. I know. I know. It doesn't help that her character does look genuinely quite quite <laughs> concerned. Well, look at me! I'm terrifying! You are. That is you true, kind of, actually. You kind of look like you have things on your face. Okay, well, you, you've Ooh. you've managed to uh, take her out, but you only had two attack, which was impressive. I was expecting you to have a lot more there. I rolled really poor. Like, I, I rolled a lot of defense. So. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Uh, 50% wit challenge with a penalty of negative one prestige. Do I have prestige at the moment? I do. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm going to take the risk. Okay. Do it. Who needs a prestige? Leader? No! <laughs> Yay! Oh, I am glad okay. that you have failed. I <laughs> failed. Um, this has pleased me. Oh, what was the equipment that I equipped again? I equipped. I'm I'm not sure. Oh well, actually, I can check. Uh, Do you I want need me to, to tell you. I, now. I yeah, no, no, I, I checked. I'm good. Oops. But I'm good. I'm good. Uh, and I don't get to see my next quest until next turn, so. No. Nope. Sneaky sneak over here. What a sneaky sneak. Alrighty then. Where shall we go? Um, I'm thinking... Just like... Speed mine it. Oh no, I took a damage. Alright, 50-50. I might lose gold. I'm, I'm fine with that. Yeah, losing gold is always okay. Yes! We did it! Hooray! Well done. The dice favor you this day. You take a grand prize. A valuable treasure. It will be most useful in usurping the Mad King. Alright, let's equip that one there. The royal shield in battle suns and moons never miss, but count as defenses instead. Ah, that's interesting. Alright, let's have a look. Hmm. Is that another one? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> really stacking the all today. Yeah, no kidding. Well, here's the thing, is... Uh, the settlements that... Uh, Alicia takes are going to stay settled, right? Yeah. So she's going to have a high gold income anyway, so giving them extra gold probably isn't going to matter. That makes a lot of sense, actually, yeah. 
it's, that's, I mean, strategically sound, but also I have two leather armor in Battle and Perils plus one shield, and then the royal shield so that I get more defense. I think it's going to be difficult to kill. So, Which I'm fine with, because I keep getting money. <laughs> exactly. Guaranteed. I mean, unless someone kills you. Everyone, pay up. So surprise, Taxes surprise. Are due. Surprise, surprise, Avak is prestige leader again. <laughs> Avak is always happen. a prestige leader. Like, always. I'm very prestigious. <laughs> oh, dear. All right, Lady Shilab. I gotta draw some more cards from the yep. ones I burned. What happens when you burn a rot card in combat? I've forgotten. You just get a rot uh, you die, I believe. You don't actually generate rot unless you've got some sort of effect that makes that into something. Because hmm. I have a card that I don't want. <laughs> That's yeah, I'm, fa I'm fairly certain you don't do anything with it. You just burn it, unless unless yeah. you gain something from rot die, it does nothing. Burn it in a challenge where you're pretty certain you're going to succeed anyway, so that you can just get it out of your hand and draw back up. To yeah, I can. I can hang on to it until I get a peril. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes they're useful in perils as well. That's good. Oh shit. Nice. Teleport. 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 Very nice indeed. Uh, well, I gotta redeem myself somehow. Okay, I'm doing my questy thing. Uh, I was uh, sitting on top uh, of your uh, quest. Uh, ah, that's what she said. Yeah. That's that's what, why she that's said. why you were like, don't tell everyone that. And I, obviously, you weren't even listening. Yay! <laughs> Gorgeous. I looks was distracted. So charmingly clueless. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Does, is it just me, or does that bear remind you of Winnie the Pooh? Reminds me of uh, some of the bears from Gummy Bears. Winnie the Pooh was my hero when I was little because I used to love honey, and I was <laughs> like, wow, you get to eat honey out of like a big pot and just stick your paw in it. <laughs> How cool. I mean, she loves dreams. His jovial attitude and his happy-go-lucky nature, but no, it's the honey. Yeah. Totally. It's the source of his honey. jovial, happy-go-lucky nature. If all you ate all day, oh. every day, was basically oh, no. liquid sugar. Why did you go into marsh? Because I was stupid and I didn't read the tile. Oh, okay. It's not like you haven't got enough HP to be able to tank it. Okay, um... Go with one of those. I kind of feel that uh, as Sargon, you need to uh, uh, assume a demonic aspect. Yeah, pretty much. Is it the is it the aura that's tipping you off to that? And, you know, the whispers from the void. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. And teleportation. I love the animation, though. Yeah, it's that, really that, good. Is amazing. It is good. Um. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this pleases me greatly. This this definitely pleases me. All right. Yum yum yum. Magic yum yum yum. What's magic? Wow. Okay. Uh, that's handy because now I can. You have. Um, I can do that. Wow. Poop. Mm. <clears throat> interesting. Oh, those two together are the interesting. Interesting. Okay. You played a what to a where? Agent, Agent of, misfortune. of Misfortune. What a dick! <laughs> Why would you do this to me? <laughs> um, that's okay, it's still an easy uh, easy one to succeed. Yeah. Unfortunately. Since you'll okay, automatically so got... get the first one. And, yeah. oh my lord. <laughs> yeah, this is fine. I, I'm good with this one. If you um, fail to get a moon, 
I'm gonna glass. roll. I could have burnt. I'm just gonna roll though. Yeah, I got. It. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Oh, well wow. done. That would have made me laugh genuinely if you'd failed. <laughs> it's like, oh, your hubris! It has come back to bite you in the backside. All right. Um, how about I? Wait, where are you? Oh, that's not you. That me, is me. I'm up oh, by the tangled forest, or whatever that tile is called. What was that card called, Balash? Uh, it was a wall of thorns. Wall of thorns. Bendables. Okay. That'll end my turn. I'm gonna do some uh, Whoa. fortifications here. Whoa! That was quite Don't mind me. amazing Just, uh, to behold, I must confess. You're making Brunswick great again. So you can put walls Mine's around your village. to enter. Yep. That. Why so it makes a bear not do any of this stuff. Okay. Ah. You get to cast lots of spells. Right. Yeah. Uh, well, I guess um, I'm going to go this way. Please do something good. That is okay. Money. I accept. Money is almost always good. Okay. Let's see then. Questing. Uh. to health. Uh, is that your second quest? No, it's my first. Got a 50% oh. chance to lose half my health or get something good. Please, please. No, oh, I came down. It was literally the last two were one or the other and I failed. <laughs> poop. Poop, 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 poop. Poop, poop. Oh, well, at least it rounded down for the uh, health reduction. Okay, well, uh, I'm good with that. Bonk. Okay. And it's night time. And unfortunately, also the end of the episode. That is very true. Uh, first is Lolash, I think. Yeah. No, Sheila. Uh, Sheila. No, goes. Sheila's up next. Sheila so, uh, first, yeah. yeah, we'll wrap this up there. Thank you very much for joining hey. us, everyone. We hope you all enjoyed, and we'll be uh, joining us for the next. But until then, take care. Bye, everyone. Bye, you guys. <laughs>